Welcome back, everyone. For some uh, young local gymnast, winning feels great, but to win on a big stage in front of a hometown crowd, of course, makes you feel even better. This week's Cakeland Cares wins for Kansas is the Wichita YMCA. And joining us now is Nicole Diaz and uh, YMCA gymnastics coordinator and Addison Austin, YMCA gymnast that will be competing at the national championships. Very impressive. And you say you've been to the national championships before. Mm -hmm. I went to it last year in Florida. Okay, in Florida. It was in Tampa. Mm -hmm. Okay, and does uh, everyone on the team get to go to the national championship? First of all, how many people are on the team with you? Eight. Eight. And does everybody go to the national championships? You have to qualify for it. Okay. And, uh, but you said this year the entire team qualified. Yeah. Wow. For my level, they qualified. Well, that's, that's something. So, and has it been here in Wichita before? Can I know it's coming up on it's Century 2, right? here? Not the gymnastics one. Okay, so this will be the first time you've gotten to compete in front of a hometown crowd. Yeah. <laughs> it's got to be a little nerve-wracking. Mm -hmm. I, I saw in the story we, we showed just a little bit ago that uh, someone said, it might have been you, that uh, you're afraid that you might fall off the beam. <laughs> I would think you're probably plenty capable of just staying on the beam. Yeah. There's other little details I'm sure you have to work at. And boy, to achieve such perfection, obviously there's a lot of practice. And how, how much practice do you say you put in? Four days a week for four hours. Four days a week for four hours? And mm -hmm. that's during the school year too? Yeah. So is it this before school or after school? It's after school. After school. And you still have time for your homework. Yeah. <laughs> Got to get those math grades up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, and how are you? So you're running the team. You're the organizer. You're um, the I'm actually one of uh, the competitive coaches mm -hmm. as well as the coordinator um, at the Y. My director, Jennifer War, is also coaches team. She's just um, not here right now. Okay. And you must be proud of your girls, I all am. eight qualifying for the national championship. Yes. I'm very proud of them. Um, I have a lot of the little ones too. Mm -hmm. um, as a team total, we have about 70 kids on our team. 70? And really? all of them qualified. So. Wow. Really that excited. Is something. Yes. And so do you have to get all of them to the national championships, <laughs> wherever that might be? Yes. Um, this year it's a little bit easier because I have parents' help. Um, a lot of the times the parents will actually take them to nationals and then we um, go on the day that they compete. We pick them up and, okay. yeah, all 70. Yeah. All right. So there will be a huge crowd in town, though, in Century 2. So because how many are all states involved? Like how many kids mm -hmm. total might be there? There is, you, we're expecting about a little over 5,000 parents, kids, wow. everyone over. Um, 21 states are coming. Okay. Um, so we're expecting a good turnout. 1,200 gymnasts are competing. Really? So yes, it's okay. very big. Sounds and like a huge deal. It is. Well, thank you very much for being here. Good luck in the competition. Thank you. So I'm sure you'll do great. And uh, wish luck to the rest of the team as well. So. All right, we're well, coming up here in just a couple of weeks, so that'll be fun. All right, uh, tell me the exact uh, time, the date, and time once again. Century 2? Um, it'll start Century 2 on Thursday. It starts at 8 a.m., and it'll go all the way from like 10 in the evening. They compete Thursday, Friday, Saturday is our finals. Okay, so and the date one more time? The I believe it's the 24th. 4th, yeah, okay. Well, thank you very much. Thank Should you. be a good time. Appreciate it very much. All right, we'll be right back.